A big part of what we do is risky play and it's so essential for the children to learn how to manage risk, to take risks because it builds their confidence and their resilience. So we're certainly not somewhere that cuts out the risk from their play. We do have risk assessments obviously but we use risk benefit assessments so that the benefit where it outweighs the risk. We don't want them to lose their confidence so it's creating an environment where they can take risks up to the point that they're comfortable with and challenge themselves um, and generally we find that the children know what their limit is so they won't push themselves too far. Obviously we're on hand and we have risk assessments in place to, um, to make sure we know how to manage and what our boundaries are and there's certain rules the children know they can't do so one of our morning routines is before we play in the woods together we do a risk assessment together and make sure the woods is safe so one of the staff team will take all of the children together for a walk around the woods that we play in and look out for it. There's four things on the list which the children know. That's litter, glass or sharp things, any poo because we're alongside the cycle path so dogs come through this, this space and um, to look at how much the trees are dancing so we know if the trees are safe, if it's too windy or not. And so once the children have helped us do that, then they're free to play. So it's helping them to know what the risks are and it helps us as well because it's one last thing for us to do by ourselves in the morning.